to a semantic backup exec tutorial today i'll be uh, showing you uh, how to uh, run a, a test run for any backup job so first thing you have to launch the backup exec user interface it will load your uh, settings okay so um, once uh, you have the user interface up and running uh, go ahead and click on uh, job monitor tab okay where uh, it will list all your uh, backups so right click and you can select a test run okay so you will see a pop-up saying that test run is a backup option on a backup job definition that runs a test of the most relevant backup task so i will just go ahead and click on yes and it will run a test run okay so it depends upon i mean in the test run it will it will uh, check about the uh, for the resources availability the credentials and your uh, storage destination whether the tape drive or uh, the tape is available or not okay so um, let's see so it's, it's running now it's queued okay and you see uh, it, it's showing us discovering resources that means your backup content maybe your service or folders whatever uh, you configured under your backup job so it, it moved to schedule so I guess uh, it should be uh, finished so here it shows test run is finished I just double click on it it will open the job log of the test run what exactly uh, it have done see job let's see the job information see it it performed credentials check it performs the media capacity check that's it so yeah it also check whether how much byte count your backup job is so this is how you will run and the other way to run a test run is you can click on here a test run it will perform the same uh, operation here active running test run queued and it will uh, discover the resources and it will check the uh, media and the size of the backup so it's finished So this is the test run. You'll see the same information here. So that's it guys. Uh, this is how uh, you'll perform a test run on any backup job. Stay tuned for more uh, videos uh, on semantic, semantic backup exit tutorials. Thank you and have a nice day.